Today in this video we will see how to set up Node.js and Express Server in TypeScript. So let's get started. For that I am going to create a new folder called Node.ts and I am going to go inside it and inside here I am going to open cmd and I will write code dot to open my VS code inside this folder. So my VS code is here. Now I will open terminal and type npm init hyphen y. This will create a package.json file. Okay, it's here as we can see. Okay, now we will create a we will install express as well as dot env. So let's install npm i express dot env okay okay so it's installed now we will create an index.js file we are not creating dot ts we are, we are creating js first okay now i will quickly create express server so for that we need to do const express equals require require express const dot env equals require dot env and then we will say dot env dot config evoke it const app equals to express again evoke it and now we will say app dot listen we will have a port number so for that we will do const port equals process dot env dot port otherwise 5000 we will create a env file dot env and inside here we will write port five thousand okay good now we will pass this port as well as a callback function which will say which will log server running at port and then we will have this port okay and now we will use app.get app dot get rec and res and I will say res dot send hi there ok let's see if it's working so i will write node index server running at port 5000 so we will visit port 5000 localhost 5000 and it's saying hi there and it's working okay so now what we will do is we will install typescript we will close this terminal and clear it npm i typescript npm i hyphen d typescript let's install it first
now we will need types for express as well as for nodes for node so for that we will do npm i hyphen d at type forward slash express and at type forward slash node s types just hit enter and it should be here in our dev dependencies yes it's installed okay after that what we are going to do is we are going to create the tsconfig.json file for that we have to do npx npx tsc typescript compiler dash dash init this will create a tsconfig.json file okay it's here now we will search for out directory in this so out dir and comment this line and write this leave everything as it is save the file now we will go and change this to ts instead of js so do ts okay and we will import it like this way import express from express import dot env from dot env okay this is working next we are going to use typescript here so we will need type for express express app okay and then we will we will we'll be having type for request and then response okay so we can give the type here express then we can give the type here request and response now we will go back to the package.json file and in here we are going to write some script so we will delete this test script and we will first write a build script build will be simple npx tsc okay then we will have a start script and this will be node dist slash index dot js then we will have a dev script which will use concurrently package which we will install in a minute concurrently slash npx tsc watch nodemon hyphen q dist slash index dot js forward slash and this is how our script will look like okay next we are going to install concurrently as well as nodemon as a dev dependency so we will open the terminal and i will do npm i hyphen d concurrently as well as nodemon okay so nodemon and concurrently is installed now now we can do npm run dev it's going to throw an error in the first time because it's not going to find index.js file that's why it's throwing error 
module not found you, you can see here index.js is not found because it was not in the district list folder but now it's created so if we will run the command once again then it should be working let's clear the console and run it again server is running at what 5000 okay so it's working so if we will go to our server it's saying hi there and if we will change the message we are brave coders i am changing inside index.ts file as you can see not inside the js file and as soon as i save it it's going to change detect the change and restart our server and now if we will go to here and reload and we are brave coders here so this is how you can develop the node js app using typescript i hope you guys will like the video thank you so much for watching i will meet you in the next one Thank you.